because I feel stupid for being played again. When I should have just left that fucking door closed. When do I start being toxic to myself? Yo, I really hate that I keep letting myself get played. And not even so much that I let, you know, I let myself get played. I just hate that I keep playing myself in the sense that I, I'm so quick to forgive. I, I have a very forgiving spirit and I think that a lot of people take that shit for granted because I hate when someone finally speaks up when they haven't responded to your text in three months and they give you some bullshit excuse about, you know, life has been life and, and that sometimes they'll see the message and they'll think that they've responded and they haven't yet. But then they reach out and they do the small talk bullshit of, hey, what's up? And you're like, get to the fucking point. What do you want? And so they leave with an apology and you accept the apology and you're like, you know what? That's maturity. That's growth. And so you explain to them how that made you feel the last time. And, you know, you're just like, well, I didn't want to reach out or whatever. But since you brought it up, I'm going to go ahead and talk about it now. Not any type of harsh way or whatever. It was just, and you express that. They heart the comment and they're like, yeah, I, I thank you for letting me know. And then they turn right around to do that same shit. Like then from there, after they've asked you the question for what they messaged you for, they go radio silent when you send back messages. Your, your messages from there are not responded to. And that shit really pisses me off because if it wasn't family, it'd be so much easier to just, you know, cut the person off. What do you think about that? Like, do you find it hard to cut family off? And if not, how do you do it? Because for me, there's people that I've cut ties with that I don't speak to, and we have that mutual understanding. So they're not reaching out to me, and I'm not reaching out to them. But it's those people that's in that gray area. And I think that I've just gotten expired of the feeling of grayness in my life. I need color. I need, I need vibrancy, or I need black and white. I need to know what's up or what's down. Don't give me this in-between bullshit because I get attached and I think that we have grown and that you're doing the work, you've gone to therapy, but now we're not there. Like you, you go right back into the old habits just so quickly. And I always feel like shit for doing, for, you know, being the one to respond. Because before that it was like, you know, I just keep it very short very short, like one and two word responses, or I just, you know, acknowledge the, the message by I double tap it or whatever, but I keep it moving. Like, all right, fine. I'll, and then after I see the message, I, I delete the conversation. So that it's not in my face. But I'm just having a hard time with that right now because I feel stupid for being played again when I should have just left that fucking door closed.